In this video, I'll show you how to use FFI in Foundry. FFI stands for Foreign Function Interface. What it will allow us to do is execute other programs from inside this test. For example, from inside this test, we'll be able to execute some Linux command or maybe a Python program. In this video, I'll keep the example simple. And what we're going to do is execute a Linux command. So here I have a file prepared. This simple text file has two words, hello foundry. Now the Linux command that I want to execute from inside the foundry test is, is to just simply print out this content inside the file using a Linux command. So what I would do when I open my terminal is say cat, the name of the file is ffi underscore test.txt. And if I execute this command, I see the content inside the file. And I want to do the same thing using Foundry. So to do this, the function that we'll need to call is called bm.ffi and we'll pass in some commands. Now this commands will be an array of strings. So I'll say string bracket memory. I'll name it commands cmds. This will be equal to new string bracket n. And the elements of this string will be the first element will be the command cat. And the second element of this array will be the name of the file. So we'll initialize an array of strings having length 2. So the first string that we'll put in this array will be cmds of 0 will be equal to cat. This is a Linux command to print out the content of a file. And the next element in this array cmds will be the name of the file. cmds1 is equal to the name of the file will be ffi underscore test dot txt. And then we execute this command by typing bm.ffi, passing in the commands. Now this will return the outputs in bytes. So I'll say bytes memory res is equal to execute the command. And lastly, we'll console log the output. So say console.log string res. Save the file and let's execute this test. So I'll put my terminal and then type forge test dash dash match path test the name of the test is ffi.t.sol now to enable ffi we also have to pass in the parameters dash dash ffi and lastly we want to see the output from the console log so say dash bbb and then execute the test okay the test ran successfully and you can see inside the logs that it printed the content of the file hello foundry this was a quick video on how to use FFI inside your Foundry. In the next video, we will use this feature to do differential testing.